three e-bike test riders. Let's see which one they choose as their favorite. Stick around. Hey everyone, I'm Dustin. I have nearly 20 years experience in the bike and e-bike industry. And today I've got three, well, almost first time e-bike riders. They just rode e-trikes for the first time. Mike's got some experience on e-bikes, but the other two have never ridden two wheel electric bikes. They're gonna try them for the first time today and see which one they pick as their favorite. Now, before we get into it, all the e-bikes are linked in the description below if you wanna check them out. Uh, also, don't forget to hit subscribe and stay in touch with us to be the first to know about all the new content we're putting out, giveaways we do, and of course, new product releases. All right, so we've got our three riders back here. We're gonna introduce you to them, get to know them a little bit, and then see them test ride all of the e-bikes here and pick their favorite. All right, let's start right here. Tell them your name, your height, and um, your bike riding. Um, How often you ride I'm bike? Bruce. Um, five foot eight, 200 pounds, and um, 68 years old. And, and you ride bikes every day? I ride bikes, just not an e-bike. Cool. All right. Hi, I'm Mike, I'm 56, um, I'm 5'10", and I ride a bike every day. Perfect. I'm Regina, 51, 5'5", five, five. I'm not saying how much I weigh, <laughs> and I ride bikes um, just about every day. Every day, Never cool. an e-bike, though. And Mike and Bruce are our today. Navy veterans here. So uh, thanks for your service. Thank you. And we're gonna get them on e-bikes for the first mm -hmm. time. So we just introduced them to e-trikes. I wanted them to try the trikes first. If you wanna check out that video, it's on our channel. You can watch them do that. And now we've got some two wheel e-bike options for everyone. Um, so we'll start down here and walk you guys through everything. So everything on the e-bike is exactly the same as the e-trike. Uh, you've got your display. Now, some of the displays and the throttles are a little bit different on each model. I'll walk you through it one by one. So we'll start on here, which is our around the block. This is our beach cruiser um, e-bike power buttons right here. This is a 500 watt rear hub motor. Um, it's got seven speeds. It's got a push throttle right here on your left hand. And you can do your pedal assist up and down right here. Who wants to go first? Also, they come in different colors too, so don't be uh, turned off by the, the mint green, Bruce, if it doesn't. No, it's good. <laughs> yeah. and we can raise the seat too, Mike, or We're you good. can just keep it. We're good. Yeah, I'll be curious to hear. <clears throat> the gears, they just, they don't come into play when you're in, in just using the electric, right? Well, they can. I mean, you, you can feel a difference if you shift the gears. Oh, yeah? Well, if you're not pedaling, they won't have any effect. If you're pedaling, yeah. Okay, if you're not pedaling, no effect. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, but as you're pedaling, changing the gears will actually make a big difference in how the pedal assist feels. Right. Yeah. Oh, wow, this is cool. That pedal assist works really well. What about seven? What do you mean about seven? Yeah, that baby goes. <laughs> what do you think of the riding position and stuff? Oh, good. Yeah? That handled good. Regina's going to like that too, I bet. You guys are obviously two wheel bike people, I think. Oh, yeah. Right? yeah. On the trail, this you can? This thing is sick. <laughs> this thing is so sick. Wow. I went all the way to I love it. This is my new wow. favorite bike. <laughs> you like it? I love this one. I knew you'd like that bike. This thing is pretty cool. Yeah. That's like her bike, yeah. What's that bike run? This one's a thousand. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, that's way that's, that's, too... That, that's, that's reasonable. That's, that's so doable. Be, that was way more than that. <laughs> yeah, compared to... Yeah, that's... That's a good bike. Was, that's that's what that made him crazy. Like, how expensive I have a feeling you guys are going to... Well, we'll see. We'll see. I have a feeling you're going to think like this all one, of them This one's comfortable favorite. in so many ways. Okay, so this one's more powerful. So this is a 750 watt, which is probably what your Sondors is. It I'm is, guessing. yeah. Yeah. Um, this is a twist throttle. Okay. So you just twist it again, and then your brakes, everything else is the same. This one's going to be more zippy, though. Um, Uh-oh. Regina may or may not work for you because it's a little bit higher off the ground, so we'll see. Yeah. Dude, this is the bike right here, man. I like this bike a lot. Dude, this, 
bike. You, yeah, is this what you're talking about? Because this is a good bike. I thought you'd like it because it's, it's real powerful. Yeah, and it's, oh, I mean, it, 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 man, that's a, that's a cool bike. That's like, that's, you know, I'm up high and I ride, it's like a Sundor, definitely. It's cool. I, I really like that one. I really like that bike a lot. And that's considered fat okay, tire too. Throttle. Those are, yeah, those are there three inch. Okay. So trying to keep them a little thinner. Yeah. But um, I, like I prefer those the, over the ones that they're real, real knobby. Huge huge, yeah. Cause I've seen I people like, like, yeah. like, like eat it on those a lot, like turning too, too fast or something. Or, yeah. That bike is really comfortable. That was a, that's a, that's a neat bike. <laughs> <laughs> cool. How much did I go for? That one's about 1500. Well, that's still not bad. Yeah, it's not at all. Yeah, we try to be really more reasonable. That, that was really reasonable. We try yeah. to be more affordable than a lot yeah. of the other brands, or at yeah. least on the good quality, but not super expensive, you know? But that bike right there is, whoo, that's a It's kind of nice goofy, bike. but I like the chrome pedals. I don't right? know if that's a weird thing to yeah, notice. Right? It is kind of cool. <laughs> I like, I really yeah, like the chrome yeah. pedals. <laughs> Very cool. Let's put this down to, all right, let's lower this. Oops. All right, see if that works. <clears throat> I have a sneaking suspicion too, Regina's not 5'5", five five, but I'm just gonna throw that out there. I am, I am, <laughs> I am. Okay, now wait, it has to be on one, you said? There you go. What'd you think? I think, okay, top speed was like 20 miles an hour. If I like was gonna buy a bike and I said I wanted to go 25, could you accommodate that? No. No? That's the restriction, right? There's a restriction. So in pedal assist, you're allowed to go up to 28 while you're pedaling. Um, oh, so when you're, if you're not in pedal assist, it's only gonna go that 20, you, when you- It'll let you go to 28 in pedal assist with just the throttle, it'll cut at 20. Um, I know that. We don't, we're going to follow the laws. There's other right, e-bike right, brands right. that, you know, maybe would. Yeah. Um, but to make sure we're selling stuff compliant for California, we set it so it kills at 20 so miles California has a, a lot of restrictions? Most states do. Okay. Uh, most of them have a speed limit um, okay. or and, a, and or a motor limit. Oh. It's any combination of the two, two either the motor size or the, yeah. I would say most are kind of in line with California, which is the 20 miles an hour and a 750 quick. watt motor. This well, yeah, thing is quick. You can't follow the rules, you don't get to shut down, I'm sure if not, and that exactly. would be not good, yeah. What'd you think, Regina? It's good. I, I don't know what kind of bearings you use, but they're crazy. <laughs> they, they are, they <laughs> they're really cool are. Bike. Cause you can coast <laughs> forever on those suckers, well, man. That, yeah. that bike right there is probably by far the best bike I've ridden right now, so far right now. I wanna go faster. All yeah, right, let's move on cool. to this one. Um, same motor size as the first one, except you've got the nice step through frame. So it's easy to mount and dismount. Okay. Who's going for Mike, why don't you go first just so okay. the seats, cause the seats okay. up, we can leave it. Go Mikey, go. Are the tires on that one as thick as these tires? Yeah, Okay. same, different tread though. Those are more of a slick tread. These are a little more of that knobby tread. <clears throat> what is it? Oh, that's the reflectors all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Actually, by law, you have to have reflectors in both wheels to meet the uh, consumer product safety testing. Oh, right on. Yeah. Safety's that's way overrated. Good. Safety's <laughs> way overrated. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't like the looks of that. Hmm? I like the looks of that. Yeah, it's a this crank? one's folding Rocket. too, actually. Yeah, this yeah this whole like the what's it, what does that be called like brushed aluminum or that that the way yeah. this looks. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. That looks good too because how you this is the same color in the motor in the back. Well, I don't I like know. It. I spoke too soon. This is a good bike too. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this, this is nice. It's, it's quick, it's cool. It, it rides a little bit different. Rides, I think it rides a little bit smoother than that one. Maybe because it, maybe it's wider, <clears throat> but this is a cool bike. Who's going next? Bruce, you up? All right, yeah. You're gonna like this one, Bruce. This is, that's a, this is a nice bike. That's really nice, yeah, I like that. This is the pretty sick the way this chain guard is on here. 
The way it shows the, Dude, that, the that's sprocket like, right here. I like both of those, man. That's, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. That's, I've never seen that before. Yeah, it's like kind of a slim look where, yeah. Yeah, so because of like, I'll, like I've had a few bikes for the sprocket. And I mean, you can like personally get, you know, the sprocket, like there's this bike guy where we live that you can get him like just about whatever design you want on there. But but you never get to see it because the chain guard covers it. Right, right, right. And Mike, check this out over here. Does this come in a different color? It does, yeah. Cream see, I like this. and navy. The, the oh, chain guard oh. right there or whatever. The, look at the chain guard on this one. How it shows oh, the... Is wow. that bad? That's pretty bad though. That is. Yeah, that is, that is cool. Huh. That is, it is, isn't it? Yeah. I like that, that you, round yeah. one that went to like four leaf clover on that one. But that's pretty cool. Little details like that, they've done a lot. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, for sure. You, yeah, you didn't design it. Did you design these? Mm -hmm. and the I colors know, and that's, everything. Oh, like you picked, impressed. like you that's picked awesome. that up. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've did. never seen, I've never a seen job. a chain guard like that before. Ever, ever, ever. Wow. Yeah, this one handles really nice. Doesn't really it? nice. Yeah. It's cool. Step through is nice, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I like that, especially at my age. <laughs> the, the, the everybody's got it going pretty much. Man, those I, those are, sometimes those are I just have to get on those bikes with the seat up, and it's not, not easy. Yeah, yeah, when I get that seat up too high, it's, yeah. it's, it's hard. Cool, man. Isn't it? It's a nice riding bike. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it rides well. I think it I think, rode, it rides I, think really I, well. I ride. I liked it better than that yeah. one. Oh, you did? Handling. I like that one. That one's, you know, I like both of those. Those two are good. They're, they're good. Somebody. I think that, it was that might be the best bike I rode right there so far. Yeah, that's a cool ass bike. That na the navy, I bet that's a cool color, huh? The navy blue. I bet that. Does that stripes on it too? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, navy and cream. Wow, so you designed all that. You've been doing it a while. You, that's impressive. You did a great job. It's, I'm very impressed. It's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, good job. It's neat. Now, if you service them, you always said you get service the bikes. Where do you service the bikes? Anywhere or? Um, you bring them down here or? If there's people local, otherwise we usually will help people find mobile mechanics. <laughs> oh, there is mobile mechanics out there. Yeah. But I mean, any time you would need parts like batteries or motors, we can obviously supply so three, yeah. it. And controllers too. Yeah, that'd be the best thing to do. Yeah. Because you need to this get the specific cool controller to yeah. the specific I don't know. I think bike. this is my That's new right. favorite. Because the motor's on it. that? <laughs> I think this one's my new favorite. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, the call, this is the, called the simple step through because it's easy to mount and dismount. Really nice yeah, it's cool on the, oh. my bike, actually, my regular bike, is that on the side of the frame right here, it has a bottle opener. Oh, okay. <laughs> you never know. I've seen those, yeah. <laughs> That's, That's my best feature, I think, my favorite feature <laughs> on the bike. Now, if there's a radio on it, that'd be the next best thing. <laughs> All right, so let's do this one. Okay, so this one is yeah. real zippy. So mm -hmm. I recommend start out in pedal assist. Don't use the uh, throttle to get going. Okay. And what's the reason behind that? He says really fast. Really powerful really in the rear wheel. Quick off the, quick um, off the air So you could pop a wheelie. <laughs> I know you're looking to do that, Bruce. I know, Just, you know like, what? So the problem being. I want to use pedal assist. Once you get going, then you <laughs> can oh, the kick in the loose. throttle. But they wait till you're up and moving a little bit. Oh. The handlebars are loose. Oh, they're loose? Yeah. I think we should be I should have let Bruce lapse. go first. <laughs> <laughs> I like that, that black bike. There's a couple of mine. I like about three are about my favorite. What? Those, the, this two and that one are my favorite. Yeah, this one or that one? Yeah. I like the, I like the steps, even though it's know. a girl thing. Yeah. No, it's not. Yeah, it's not? I don't think so. I think they're, they're going more towards that. It's yeah. easier, more towards that. I think they've got to crack my leg up all the oh, way. Oh, yeah, especially if, I'm, if i got groceries on yeah, my rack. right? It's, it's hard, it's hard. You know? Heck yeah, I can't get my leg up that <laughs> high better sometimes. Better with, yeah, the steps are, there's, there's it's not a girl thing. It's, 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 there's a warm unisex. Is probably all these are all unisex. I think. Of course, yeah. Yeah, and they're all you know. Yeah, I sort of like that step through, you know, because sometimes I get groceries on my yeah. bike and I can't get my yeah. damn leg up high That's enough. That's right. Absolutely. You know? I think the gears need to be yeah shifted. I was going back and forth between it, but it, it seems like it was in between gears. Oh, still in between. Yeah, and I went through all of them. Let me take a look real quick.
Okay. All right. So the seat might still be low, but no, we're good. Okay. You just start start pedaling. Yeah. Right? The white walls on the little on the little bike look look so cool though. <laughs> the what? The white walls because they're just little chubby little guys. You know what I mean? <laughs> I love white walls on bikes. It looks so like classy. So what are you thinking so far, Regina? I like the black one. I like the black one. I kind of like the way this one looks just because I like that this kind of frame a little bit better. But the way that one feels is a lot more like, um, I just feel like more secure, kind of more just uh, just like safe, not safe necessarily, because I guess that's up to the rider. If you know I mean. But um, it just feels like just more, I guess, safe. Is where I'm yeah, thinking. fits you better. Yeah. You know, all, all your trikes are turned on. Turned on? Are but they? Tail lights are on. No. It's a, oh, it's... this one just has the brake light on that one stays on because I have the parking brake engaged. Oh, okay. Yeah. Never <laughs> mind. This is a zip. I like these. <laughs> I like all these. These actually are good. These are cool. This is zippy. Here, here you go, Bruce. It's zippy. It's off to start. Man, like right now. Is that frame? This, this frame is cool. a little bit longer than this one, okay. or no? That's, that's right. Yeah, this one's a little longer. It, it handles that one really handles. You guys well. will see a this difference one? when yeah, you get on I this one. I think it handles really well. Let me judge I, I like myself. the steering and everything. This is cool. That bike is really comfortable. Yeah, this one's fun. A lot of older riders like it because it's smaller, easier to handle. Um, real zippy. Yeah, it's, yeah, you get, you get to it. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, that's, Very lightweight too. That's cool. I've like every single one of these. I've really liked. They're, they're, <laughs> they're, they're nice. I mean, it's like you say, because I'm used to the, the, the regular bicycle, but every one's really, really good. That's gonna be a hard one to pick. Which one's the best? I'll tell you, because <laughs> they're all about the same. <laughs> they're really good. Can you put like a basket and stuff on these in the front? Yeah. In the front? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Of course. Right on. And you could put, what about these handlebars? Could you use regular handlebars like that on this one? You can. It's a little bit of a challenging thing to change handlebars because you got to swap out all the stuff. Mm. <clears throat> but you can do it. There's yeah, this one handles really good. Yeah. It handles well, doesn't it? <laughs> Isn't it? As long as you don't try to go too sharp of a turn. <laughs> I like how you guys have the wires all like, you know, and like encapsulated in, in the, in, whatever this is all the way around because most of them just have like a little velcro thing like this big mm. that just keeps them all bundled you know what i mean and it really doesn't do a good job mm. and, but that, yeah. that's that's really yeah nice. that's like like yeah yeah i got, I got some of this what do you think bruce i like it you know what i mean but yeah, i just it, it looks it makes it a look, little bit too good makes it look yeah. good too though i mean like yeah too turn, too nimble turn on the dime but yeah it's, i it's could see good. myself over over steering that but it that's it that, that's very comfortable that's like this one yeah. right here this one like it looks freaking cool just the way it, i don't know okay we got a totally different one right here all right um this one's got a longer frame so we call this actually like a semi recumbent, semi -recumbent right? so you've got the pedals out in front a little bit more and you've got that same kind of handlebars as that last one like uh a little bit chopperish but it's a really comfortable feel. You guys will feel the difference. So who's up first? Regine, no, oh the seat's lower. And I can okay. adjust the handlebars too, mm -hmm. if you want the handlebars in a different position. No, I think we're good. Okay. All right. So are these basically like the same type as those? They're just like a different design, just like you just like that look better? Or? The handlebars? Yeah, these ones with this. Yeah, just different riding, you know, different, trying to spec them differently for who oh, I yeah, think is gonna man. ride it. Uh -huh. But you'd be willing to customize them a little bit. We don't do customization. Well, I mean, put those handlebars on it, that bike or something, you know? You can. I was saying to them, it's a, it's it is a process. You got to take all the stuff off. Oh yeah. Swap out all the you know the grips. It's not. It's actually not that hard. You just yeah. loosen screws. It just takes a little bit of time. Yeah. You know, probably an hour or two. But yeah, I mean, if you were to get one and you want to change handlebars, it can be done. Yeah, you know? what if I wanted eight hangers on that? Or yeah. The only thing you have to be aware of is the length of the cables. Yeah. So, you know, you have to make sure whatever handlebar you're switching to, yeah, you've this, got enough. These wouldn't go wide enough, be long enough for like those handlebars. Yeah. <laughs> cool, bye. 
You're laying back, just cruising on it, huh? Yeah. It's, it's cool, man. It's really cool. Different, right? Yeah, it's different, but it's awesome. It's, I'll go next to it. It's, it's almost relaxing. It's really, it's, just, it's comfortable. That was really comfortable. That, that's really cool. Man, that's cool. You're gonna like you want that. the seat down a little, or? You're no, like that'll that be Bruce. fine. No, that, that's a cool bike, too. Oh, all these are good. I know, like, I'd be really hard to choose. I can't pick which one. I mean, like, I, I couldn't know. imagine having to choose if you didn't ride it, and all of them. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Like, well, sometimes would, better know. to only try, like, you know, when, when people come to test ride, like you guys, it's makes the decision more difficult when yeah, you ride them so all. Yeah, there's so many choices, yeah. Because they are all, these are a lot That's different. That's why I don't go to pavilions. <laughs> a lot different, yeah. Not, not, you, yeah, you're not kidding. It's, now, that, now that I did it, I've done it, I'm glad I did it, because it is a, it's a big difference. I definitely like these seats, though, the way they're shaped. I want to get yeah. a seat like this though, for my bike, because the one I have, like this part of the seat, it like actually bumps up instead of yeah, and it down. has that little groove in the middle. Yeah, and it almost feels bad. like when you're gonna yeah, slide off the front like of that. it. Yeah. When you when you stop, yep. it almost feels like you're gonna slide right off the front. That's almost like kind of like riding a Harley or something. It's like almost riding a motorcycle, huh? <laughs> he must like this one. He's going for a yeah. second lap. <laughs> he does. It, it's laid back. It's, it's a laid back bike. It's that's cool. Were you saying you felt like you were gonna fall off this one? No, no, no. I'm saying oh. like my my seat on my bike, just regular bike, like how this is like like caves curves down uh -huh, a little bit. Uh -huh. it has, like, it's like my bumps. seat actually kind of bumps up slightly. Mm. So when I stop, it feels like I'm gonna like slide. Sometimes I mean, unless you know, if you're not ready for it, like it, you like you can even really easily come off. It's not. It's just not a comfortable seat. That these is this is exactly the shape of seat that I want to get. Yeah. Because everybody always goes, oh, I got a seat for you, and then it's always yeah, it's never not, the right yeah way. like this yeah. And seats are Maybe important. even just a little bit wider. <laughs> seats are important. It is. Like those half seats that they make that has this part cut off. Have you seen those? Oh, one? yeah, I've seen those. Those are like, I got one of those thinking it'd be so comfortable. It's like so sketchy. I didn't like, I can't even either. stay. I can't even stay in the seat when I'm kind really? of like, yeah. Mm. It's it's like, wow, it's, yeah, it's, it's scary. What'd you think, Bruce? This is definitely the most comfortable. According so to the speedometer, it was the fastest, but I'm, I'm unsure of that. Let me lower this for you. It's kind of like you're kicking back, huh? Just, just yeah. Screw it. It's cool, man. Lead back. Yep, right? <laughs> so you guys actually, you design them or you guys actually manufacture these bikes? Both. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, I mean, everything's made to our spec, our measurements. We pick all the colors. That's that, you know. way cool. It gives you, like, I don't know, a little more sense of, like, confidence in, like, riding it. You know what I mean? What's that? It feels like, like just knowing that it feels like a little bit more confidence in riding yeah. it. Like, mm. you know what I mean? Just to me, it does anyways. Good. But, you know, it wasn't the parts weren't sent all over the place or, all you know. I had to, uh, I had to back off a little bit on turn Did three. You, you know, you up a little bit? <laughs> Just a little bit. The guy got you. He edged out. He edged you out. She, she's going to like that bike. I guarantee it. She's going to like that bike. I guarantee that'll be the best one for <laughs> Yeah, it's, yep. it's definitely more comfortable. It's, more, it's very comfortable. Yeah. Just, I don't know, the, the what do they call it? The ergonomics? Yeah, it's just laid back. It's yeah. Just, like, you're, you're just, yeah. So you have CAD drawings and you guys do, you do a lot of CAD work Well, we that. get the factories to help do the CAD. I oh. can give them like a basic pencil drawing and I'm like, this is kind of what we want. Right um, I'm, I've also had my own CAD drawers do yeah. stuff too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the factories can really work with you. We use contract factories, you right know what on. I mean? Um, now you have to go over to China and stuff? Is that where you go? To, yeah, you we probably, do. You're probably traveling back and 29 forth. 29 miles an hour. <laughs> What's that? It said 29. Oh, that's kilometers an hour, though. Oh, I was going to say, man. <laughs> oh, that was a big guy. Like, maybe I'm going to Some of them are in miles per hour, right. and some of them yeah. are kilometers per hour. I'm not feeling like I'm going can that much faster. Just, I want to know. You know? Can, right. can we switch it to, to miles <laughs> like, per hour? I don't I'm just want to see how. I'm going 29. I have to get our uh, manual for oh, it. Okay. Yeah. Cool. This, this one's like, really comfortable. The way this is shaped is really like, just it's just comfortable. Yeah, I know. I like it. Yeah. No, it's cool. I didn't think I was going to. But I wonder why in the hell but you did it. But yeah, miles. it's like, it's way laid back. Like a tandem bike like that would be bitching. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. It's good feedback. I haven't seen any electric tandems. Do they have them out there? Electric tandem? There's not many. I haven't seen one yet. Yeah, yeah. yeah that would be perfect for tandem. Be, yeah, that idea. would just be yeah. sick with idea, it right yeah. there. Okay, I'm last but not least. Blind. Yeah. And I thought oh, we had love that. Yeah. Tandem so bike. This is called our Every Journey. So, pretty similar to one of the other ones, but we'll see what you guys think. It's 
that's going to be Mike's new favorite. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like all of them. You got, they're all great back here. Oh. Yeah, I have a, a friend of mine who's blind, and I've been thinking about getting a tandem bike, you know? Rickshaw. <laughs> I want to give him a little exercise. Yeah. <laughs> Is it Dennis? Yeah. Yeah. Dennis. He's a veteran also that lives in the building. He, he's blind from... He's only been blind like five years. Yeah, but he, what was it from what, he, what made him blind? I forget. I don't know. Something like glaucoma, but yeah, different. Yeah, yeah, I think it's sort of like But different. I don't know. Like totally blind? Yeah. yeah. He's gradually, you know, I guess he started out like seeing like that and then just, just narrow down. He's pretty much totally blind now. Yeah, I don't think, I think he sees like really bright light if it's mm. like, like, but I don't think he can tell any shapes or anything. Like Tandem that. will be great. You're right. Still yeah. get him out, get him yeah. moving yeah. a little bit. Yeah, and so just the feeling of riding a bike, because that kind of would suck if you could never ride a bike again. If mm -hmm. you ride, you know what I mean? Unless you're just somebody who never rode a bike, you know? Because mm -hmm. it's like, I don't know, just all the good feelings when you're a kid. And you know what I mean? I mean, back when we were young, you're like, we could be gone riding bikes all day long and we everybody was cool. Now you're like gone, left, you know, 15 minutes late, they send out a search party for you. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, you know, as long as you were home before it got dark, you're good. You know, you'd be gone all day long. Nobody cared if you ate or drank anything, if you were dirty, just as long as you came home before dark. <laughs> you know what I mean? Those were fun times, man. The whole, the whole block would be gone, all just right, right in the back bay. Awesome. This thing's awesome. <laughs> They're all, I really don't. <laughs> I know, like really, I couldn't this choose, this man. responsive. It's really good. This is one of the first ones you came out with, or? or? It is, actually. Is it? Yeah. yeah. That yeah. one's... Um, this one seems like it's really dialed in. It's like, I don't know yeah. what it is about it. It's This one, actually, for our yeah. regular bike. Mm -hmm. We have this in the regular bike, too. Okay. Uh, it's been our best seller for about eight years. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's... A, so people like this frame. It's called the Every Journey. It's got a little bit of a forward pedaling design. Really comfortable. Yeah. Um, you got the cruiser upright ergonomic ride, so. Yeah, yeah I never like really paid attention to that on bikes, like where the the like the sprocket is like located, or the crank is like in, as opposed to where the seat is arranged. Never even paid attention to that really. Mm. It's it makes be. a big difference, actually. Yeah, it does. I'm just, it is. I'm just how like leisurely like you feel, or like how much you have to be alert. Like you don't feel yeah. like you have to be as alert and like like focus on everything you're doing like on this one i feel like because it's more just comfortable I, I like, yeah like it, it almost I, feels like it's like autopilot kind yeah of and i like yeah. how the pedals are forward yeah yeah, yeah it's more it's more like, it's just more it's just you feel like you're more, it's not like it's not like so sketchy even when you're coming around the corner yeah it's not it's like so like like you know what i mean you just feel mm -hmm. more like safe i guess in a way is shimano they do everything basically shimano does uh yeah but this is shimano is it it is, yeah. Is that is Shimano as well? Yeah. The motor's not Shimano. That's what I have on my, on my Sondor, so I was wondering, yeah. The motor's not Shimano. Those are the, the thing? Uh, yeah, or other brands, I've heard a lot yeah. of good things about that, yeah. Yeah. How'd you like yeah, it? Yeah, it's very nice. Very, very comfortable, easy to, easy to ride. Yeah, right? Try that, see if... But I still take that other one as comfort. Which one, that black one? Um, This one? Yeah. Yeah, that one. Yeah, for comfort. Yeah, that's a. It's gonna be hard to beat that one. Yeah, it's kind of laid back and just. You just yeah. That'd be one to take out with but, the kids, you know. He's, you know, each one of them has its own special. It does. You know, feature. Like that one's really? laid back, and that one's more maneuverable, yeah, and blah blah blah. You know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If I was gonna make an official decision, like as buying one, yeah, I'd want to do lap times. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. You, you, it's, all, it's all about that? Yeah, it's yeah. all about that. Well, I get you, I get you. Well, he wants yeah, to do laps, yeah, he lap times. New lap times. He wants lap oh, times. lap times. <laughs> see, see which one you could do the fastest. Yeah. Well, the motors are all about the same. Yeah. Not irrelevant. Yeah, but you know what? Still I, I handling and all that you know, you. comes into play. Yeah, I get you. But me, I'm, ah, man, the, these, these are, these are hard. This is going to be hard to choose because they're all, they all got their thing. You, you've done, yeah. Favorite. But what's good about that for you is you, <laughs> what'd you say? You said favorite. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah, you like, like the riding position? I like this one a lot. Yeah. I just, it just feels good. I like it. It's fast too. And what's that one go for? About a thousand? More than that. Uh, yeah, about 1300. That's not bad. 1400, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like this one. What is it that particularly jumped out um, for you? It's just comfy. Just yeah. It's just, I just like it. It just feels like, um, it's not too heavy. 
Uh-huh. It just, uh-huh. um, I just like it. And normally I don't like handlebars that are that far spread apart, but that was like perfect for that ride for some reason. Okay. Because normally my handlebars, I'll have a friend of mine like bend them up a little bit right here and then maybe cut a little bit off. Okay. Because I like that shape, but just not like this for uh-huh. me, you know? Uh-huh. But that was like, that felt good though. Okay. Cool. So that, are you going with that as your pick? Yeah, 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 for sure. Okay. So Regina chose the Every Journey, which... A lot of shorter women like this one too what? because <laughs> it's got the step through, also the riding position. Um, all right, Bruce, so what are you gonna go with? Laid back. The relaxed body. Yeah. Cool, it's got a nice step through, you like the comfort. Easy rider. Easy and rider. you can feel the difference in how the seat is like lean back to, you know what I mean? So it's like, it's a little bit like lean back, but it's not yeah. so like casual, I guess like leisurely. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. So you're not pedaling like straight under your body. Basically. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, but you're not too comfortable because you like, you know, when you're riding, you're, you want to be bike riding too. Yeah. You know? Yep. All right, Mike, I know it's going to be tough for you. Picking two? Got to go two. Okay. Yep. All right. <laughs> number Tell two. us which ones yep. and why. You're kidding. Go number two. Zip and fold. To each yep. his own. You like the power yep, and the, I yeah. Did. I liked it. Yeah, everything about that was just, I just felt, it felt right. I, cool. Maybe because really the scooter, good. like type of handlebars, maybe because you're used to riding scooters too. Maybe, yeah, it, but it, just, it felt right. Which one was more comfortable? Well, it's got to be this one. Right? Or that, this one yeah. Right? This was probably the most comfortable ride. But, but that one body. was good too. I, I like that. I like sitting up high on that one. I thought I was sitting up high and I could, I like that one, number two, yeah. That's good. But I that one is, that one's comfortable. Depends on what you're going to use it for. That's like, right. You know, I like long distance and being comfortable but i think you i think know. that might yeah that, but that you don't plan on pedaling either uh, that's <laughs> right durable, that's you know? right mm-hmm. so i'm mean, using it every day you want to work you know back and forth or whatever <clears throat> what was your second pick mine yeah Mister. oh you said number two yeah, number two, yeah. oh okay i thought yeah. you were picking two no. got it a number right there and the second the second pick would be the black one the black, black one? one yeah simple three step would probably through. be the, the late you know this one right here cool but that black one was, was similar to the to the to the, to the second one i felt but i like them both so you've had e-bikes. Are you guys yeah. sold on electric bikes now? Oh, yeah. I definitely want to get Absolutely. one now. Yeah, I do too. I told them that you're going to change them. Yeah. I definitely want to make sure I get a really good Time for me cable, to. Or just type, type, a really good lock. That's for sure. A really good one. Because where we're at, that people just. Yeah. I've already had two bikes taken bike in like the past crazy. like four months. It's, I know. It's a shame. It's, the unfortunate thing is, is even no matter what lock you get, if it's a professional thief. If somebody thief, wants it, they're going to get it. They're yeah. going to get it. Yep. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, gone. that's true. Yeah. I just like to make it as difficult as yeah, possible. Yeah, of course. You know what I mean? Of course. Because somebody's going to be like, oh, there's like four locks on that. You know? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Cool. All right. Well, there we have it. They've made their choices. Each one actually chose one difference. So Regina with the relaxed body, or no, sorry. Regina went with the every journey. Bruce went with the relaxed body. And uh, Mike, Mike went with the zip and fold. So don't forget, all of them are linked in the description below if you want to check them out. If you have any other questions at all, please comment below or reach out to us, the team at 630.com or call us 310-982-2877. Don't forget, we offer a 30-day test ride your e-bike policy. If you don't love it in the first 30 days, send it back. No questions asked, no money out of your pocket. In addition to that, we warranty everything for the first year. Anything goes wrong in the first year, we take care of it, parts and labor. Lastly, join our community. Our Facebook group has thousands of members. Join the group to talk to existing riders before you purchase to ensure you make the right choice. Then when you have yours, post in the group, make friends, and finally download our app to compete on the leaderboard and track your rides. So thanks for sticking around and don't forget, it's your journey or experience, enjoy the ride.